This is a Six Degrees of Freedom tutorial. To perform a Six Degrees of Freedom analysis requires a rigid body which has been surveyed with at least six points. If the rigid body is going to rotate then there needs to be at least six points in view at any one time. This view of the helmet shows a typical example where we have a number of targets all around the helmet. From this we can track position from that in the first frame and also roll pitch and yaw relative to the first frame. This analysis is done in the coordinate system defined for the rigid body. The screen also shows the sort of analysis that can be performed. The helmet has been surveyed in a three-dimensional survey over all the surface that will be visible during the test. This survey can be performed in the Teamostatic program which is covered in a separate tutorial. The survey has been entered into a target model, an ASCII file, generated in WordPad that has a TRG suffix and which is available to be imported into Tima. Here is the ASCII file ready to import. The first line defines the units, the subsequent lines define the point number first and then the XYZ coordinates of that point. To import the target model into Tima, put the focus on the image and under the camera menu use the insert target model option, find the file and import it. Ensure that the units are correct, if not this model can be edited on screen. Notice when you import the target list they will be added to the points list on the left of the screen. Because we have not defined the camera parameters, we're being warned to do so. Right click on the image and set the camera parameters. It is best to do this with an accurate focal length derived from a lens calibration. Then in the first image you need to identify all the visible points by attaching them to the points in the point list. Now start tracking. Graphs and spreadsheets and a 3D diagram as covered in other tutorials have been set up prior to tracking. As the body rotates targets that come into view are picked up and targets that disappear are dropped. Skipping to the end of the tracking, we now have a full 6D analysis including roll, pitch and yaw and also a 3D diagram.